Hi, my name is Gary Zabinski. I'm the general manager of the historic and beautiful Genesee Theater here in downtown Waukegan, Illinois. This building was first constructed and opened on Christmas Day, 1927. The building reopened in 2004, in December, after extensive renovations. Pretty much everything you see behind me has been touched by human hands in some way or another during the uh, renovation, and it has been restored to its somewhat original magnificence. We actually feel it's much more magnificent than it was in 1927. What I thought was the most striking example of, of the restoration, the modernization of the building so that it could really compete with 21st century performing arts spaces, a larger stage, more expansive seating, wider aisles, more bars and lounges. We don't have a particular genre that we enjoy. We do comedy, we do rock music, we do classical music, Broadway, as well as uh, full-scale operas and, and orchestras on this stage. It is an opera house sized stage and it was built that way purposely during the renovation so that we could accommodate the largest type of show as well as special events such as 250 person sit down weddings with a dance floor which we have done here. We do approximately 50 to 60 live stage events a year. We like to call ourselves the uh, the premier entertainment venue in Lake County. And we had uh, Bill Cosby here. He's been here twice actually. Uh, he opened the building in December 2004 as the first performer. We have had Jerry Seinfeld, Louis Black has been here a couple of times, Bill Maher has been on this stage, Lisa Lampanelli. Musical acts have been as across the board as you can possibly imagine. We've had rap here, we do a lot of gospel stuff here. Journey has been here. I, I could go on and on. Not only do we have the stage and this uh, beautiful auditorium you see behind me, uh, but we have seven or eight other ancillary rooms off the main auditorium on various levels, which can accommodate anywhere between 20 and 150 guests, either for a corporate meeting, uh, a luncheon, um, a lecture, uh, a speaker series. Uh, we're on the um, second floor landing that leads directly into the uh, balcony. We've chosen to sort of populate it with found objects and things that uh, we have been donated by some of the citizens in the community who remember the Genesee back when they were coming to it in the 40s and 50s and 60s. Well, we've taken a lot of old archival photographs. So we've begun to make a little bit of a historical display here. This this has become a very popular corner, especially for visitors who don't come to shows very often and they come for the first time and they find themselves with a, a loge or a balcony seat and voila, uh, they get a quick, quick tour of what the Genesee was all about. There's quite a pedigree here and a, and a great history and, and Waukegan deserves to have a performing arts space like this. It is a gorgeous and very uh, enjoyable theatrical experience. You come once. Uh, we have found more often than not you will continue to look for what's coming up at the Genesee Theater because if you're going to go, you might as well go to the most comfortable and pleasant venue that you can find.